Assalamu alaikum and good morning ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to discuss about the research process. I just want to give you an overview first about the process of research. There are about six steps in making a research. First is you need to formulate a research question before you go to a proposal. In this case you have to uh, this, to, to do a lot of literature review and a discussion with your profi- professors or experts in this field and after that you will come up with a research questions and then you will this, this, this research question you have to discuss with your supervisor and you come up with uh, a research uh, proposals and from the research proposal of course you need a lot of further re- reading of uh, books and literature reviews and further discussion with expert and so on before you finalize a proposal and then you you have to design your research and this design of research involves many stages such as uh, methods of uh, data collections and this involves sampling design and design strategies such as uh, uh, the types of research the purpose the time dimension, scope, and environment. This involves uh, a special lectures on detail, how you should come up with your research design. And after that, you have to to go about collection of data. And then after collection of data, you need to have uh, analysis of data. For those who do some quantitative analysis, uh, you have to analyze uh, some statistical analysis, you can make use of certain software available in the market such as SFSIS and so on and this will help you to analyze your data and of course those who do qualitative research they need a certain uh, a relationship between a certain uh, reading he has to do a certain, for example you do a law you have to come up with a certain similarity of certain dimensions of that you have to make some quantified in different way to analyze and then there is a certain survey to help you and we'll discuss this aspect in the, in the future uh, uh, lectures and after that you should after making some analysis then you need to to interpret the data and making a proposal uh, of your research either your thesis for those PhDs and masters they have to come up with the outcome of the uh, uh, this data analysis, interpretation of data to test your hypothesis and so on. We will discuss in next lectures or rather uh, uh, after this we are going to talk about in detail how you are going to formulate your research questions and how you should come up with a proposal and later on a special lectures we discuss on this uh, design of uh, research which is very very important because it will affect the outcome of your research and that you'll be able to make some analysis and, and some uh, conclusion about your research and of course then you can write your proposal. In writing your research, there's such a subject and a special lectures on this and you will we'll discuss that in the next chapter. Okay, thank you very much for, for the next, uh, for this uh, lectures and we will meet again.